Zippo Log Mills was started by my great-grandfather and his partner in 1944. As a whole company, we have our log yard, we have our sawmill facility, we have our planter facility in Goshen, and we have the lamb plant, and we have about 150 employees. For a couple of our employees that some have already retired, they were second generation. We also try to provide a great team network, family network. If there is a young person that is pulling green chain, has an aptitude for wanting to repair things or be an electrician, we actually help them with an apprenticeship program at Lane. They actually go to Lane, they pay for the classes, and if they get a C or better, we will fully reimburse them for books and classes. Every single one you guys saw today, they've all went through the apprenticeship program. So that's been a, a great building block for us. We also do our own in-house graders at those positions. They have to go to grading class and they have to be certified in three separate grades in order to get full pay. So they're also investing in their future, but they got to put in the time and they got to get certified. They got to maintain their status. And then they know that they did their part, seeing the value that all this work they're putting in goes into these beautiful buildings, beautiful airports, and among other projects. Zippo Laminators, uh, the portion of the mill that I'm involved in is about a five-year-old company and uh, about halfway into the five years I started for them and, and I've been working with them since. From a laminating facility in terms of products, whether it be the stock type beam, so just a general beam that's used in construction, whether it's the custom beam that we're producing, for instance, at Portland Airport, that's our specialty, is doing the specialty items, so. If you work at Zippo Log Mills, it's not just a paycheck, it's a lifestyle. You have to care about the impact you're making. This job's too hard <laughs> for you to not care. But when you finally get to see what your hands have made and see the beautiful things that have come out of it, that we all had a part in it, that's the beauty. We want to do it right. We have to do it right, because that's the kind of product we want out there is right product.